A related note, real estate experts at the Jersey Shore say there is still time to find a rental. South Jersey reporter Brandon Goldner takes a look at the market. Marianne Nunez says she tells it like it is. I'm Italian, and that's what we do. And <laughs> I just want to be honest with people. Because and honestly, she says renting out her North Wildwood home has been a moneymaker. Fabulous. We've been totally rented for our two months that we rent since October. Though Maria Kirk of ShortSummerRentals.com says this year, not every homeowner looking to rent out is as lucky. It's not crazy slow, but it, it's not what people are used to. She says last year their total bookings for the summer were 95 percent. This year they expect to be at 90 percent. Kirk says it's not that people aren't going away on vacation, they're just going further away. They're traveling even to the Outer Banks or they're traveling Traveling to Mexico or Aruba, you know they're they're just they've been they've been stuck here, you know, not even in New Jersey, but just stuck home for three years. So they're they're ready to go and live again. She says Avalon, Stone Harbor, and Brigantine are some of the places that still have a lot of homes available to rent. The Ocean City-based real estate agent Doug Grisbaum says if you're still looking for a last-minute rental, don't wait too long. We're seeing a pretty good-sized push the last week or so, maybe because we're getting closer to Memorial Day weekend. Um, so if you haven't booked, I would I would secure something relatively soon. While some homeowners are banking on those last minute bookings, Nunez says she currently has a wait list of renters. We felt bad because, like a lot of our renters who rented the first season, wanted to come back the second season. And they got to us too late. We were already booked. We had to turn them down. Though experts say, with the rental market being slightly slower this year, those out of luck renters will still have other options. Brandon Goldner, CBS News, Philadelphia.